What's up guys, today we are going to do another unboxing and setup for the T-Mobile home internet. Um, so this works on any Android or iPhone. In this case we're using an Android and that's the app right there. It's T-Mobile internet and what you want to do just to make sure it runs smoothly is keep your finger pressed on the Wi-Fi thing and make sure your Wi-Fi is on but that you're not connected to any networks and if you are connected what you want to do is hit the little uh, there's like a little gear thing and just put forgotten network so you want to make sure the Wi-Fi is on but not connected to any network and then you download the the app which we I believe just did T-Mobile internet so you're gonna hit open and you want to make sure this thing is powered on so I'll plug it in there's two plugs one is standing up and up and down and you can tell by the T for T-Mobile being uh, you know up and down because these two things are exactly the same. Sometimes people call me and they're like, hey, it's not working, it's not powering on, and they're plugged into the wrong spot. So you want to be plugged into the bottom one. So the first thing you do when you take it out of the box, it just comes with the home internet, and I used another wire just to, so I don't have to take all this out, but there's a, a perfectly packed wire underneath that, so don't throw this away. And plug it in first, let it load up, and you want to put it as close to a window as possible. Um, we have five bars of signal over here, so it doesn't have to be right in the window, but here we go. So let's get you reconnected. I don't know why that showed that, but let me hit log out. Okay, set up device, and then it's going to ask you if you want to do the LTE gateway or the 5G. So this is a 5G gateway. We're going to select that. What's in the box? You just hit next, and then you don't need the placement assistant. We already do that when we process the order for you, so just hit skip placement assistant. And it says, okay, let's get you connected. Found the spot, which is near the window. And then the QR code. So scan QR code. So get the modem ready. There's a QR code right there. And what we're going to do is just hit scan code. And that's how quickly it scanned the code. And it's already connected to power, so we just hit next and wait for a gateway to start. It's already been started, so just hit skip so you don't waste time. Skip anyway. Check gateway status, just hit no. Wi-Fi permission, next, and then you just hit save. That's the network name, T-Mobile D5D2 for this particular one, and this is where that's listed. Right there, and the password is right there. Don't get it confused with the admin password. Now what we're gonna do is make a custom network name and password, unless you wanna keep the one that comes on the device. And this is what um, somebody wants us to put in there. So as soon as this thing comes up, we'll put that in there and we'll hit save. And that way the customer, all they have to do is come in, pick up the modem, take it home, put it in a window. Uh, the most ideal place would be a second story window. Okay, so here's the network name and password. We're just going to clear that out of there. And we're going to put just a different keyboard than I'm used to, but norm. Uh, 7187 and then the password we'll delete that out of there and is that all Normal. caps or uh, no just capital N okay so just and capital then, yeah. N and then O R M Y O R M Y I don't know how you use this keyboard I like the QWERTY one because that's what we're used to on the regular keyboard normie 123 Okay, and then we're just going to hit submit, and it says it takes about 20 seconds, and it'll look like something is messing up once it's done, but all it's doing is just programming it. See, we have five bars of signal, and once this thing starts acting crazy, nothing's wrong with it. All you have to do is uh, go back to the Wi-Fi. It says we couldn't get you connected automatically. That's fine. We don't need that. So all we want to do is swipe down, and now we're going to search. Turn the Wi-Fi off and back on. And let's see if that network name shows up. Norm7187. Sometimes it takes a few seconds here. Right there. Norm7187. Now, I could click that and type in the, the password, but if you don't want to go through all that, if you have a newer phone, you could select this item right here. And then all you have to do is scan that QR code again. What that does is puts the network name and password. Find QR code. Yes, that's the QR code. 
What's going on? Let me go back and do it again. Okay. I don't know why it doesn't like that, but... No, it should go in any direction, but that's okay. We'll just uh, select it. We'll type in the password, capital N O uh, R M Y one, two, three, and connect. Connect it. There you go. And now we can test it out. We can go to like YouTube or something and see how fast. And let's put. Milan T-Mobile. And if you want service, we are based in Las Vegas, licensed in all 50 states. Oh, it skipped the T. Yeah, we're based in Las Vegas, licensed in all 50 states. So if you want T-Mobile home internet or if you have any questions, feel free to call or text anytime, 702-300-8488. That's one of our videos. Or you can type in Modern Utilities or Milan, T-Mobile, and uh, yeah, we'll leave it in the description below, 702-300-8488. Um, you can stop by and see us. We're on Sahara and Valley View in Las Vegas, 3441 West Sahara, or call and uh, or text, and we can process orders all around the United States. Right now, we're giving a free $50 gift card for joining, uh, free activation, free shipping, um, actually, they just raised the gift card to $150, so take advantage. Um, I think it's going to be going on for, what, the next couple weeks? So, yeah, thanks for watching. If you like these type of videos, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, share, and have a blessed day. Thanks.